Where the hell is she? Really? Fuck! How? Okay, that was funny. I was gonna say, how is he not dead? I took all his fucking health. Oh, that was funny. Alright. So, this is weird, but, uh, basically... Right now, I am talking after this match has happened because uh, my computer had an update last night and basically uh, my microphone just stopped working and I didn't realize it, so I did this match and it's a good match, but uh, you know, I can't fake uh, pretending like I'm playing the game live right now, but I'm just going to go ahead and, I don't know, kind of commentate a little bit here and there. We'll see how this goes. I've never done this before, but yeah, I totally lost all my commentary. Um, it was never recorded, so. Oh, shit. Oh shit. I haven't watched this yet. Like I said, this happened last night, but uh... Yeah, right now I'm playing super aggressive because I want to beat John's record of six kills in a match. So basically... I need to kill like three people right off the bat. You, you have to kill people constantly. You know, you're not really gonna have time to um... Loot and all that stuff, so I just have to find a weapon, hopefully get lucky with maybe finding a good mod for it. I like shock a lot. I also like the uh, throwing hatchets too. To... Oh god. How did I survive that? Holy shit. I don't know. I came that close to dying at the beginning of this match. Son of a bitch. Throw a mine down. Yeah, I'm just gonna take a tactical retreat. Hell yeah, I love this looting spot. If you're playing this game, or if you want to play this game, I'm telling you, like, there's these two pharmacies right here. They have a fridge and two cabinets each. And they usually have painkillers. You want those pain relievers. They're actually pain relievers. You can use a pain reliever to actually stop bleeding, too. You don't have to stop and do the animation of pulling out. Ooh, shit. Really helps to find a weapon like that. All I need is a good mod for it. Throwing hatches are my shit too now. I'm loving them. They cause people to panic. They want to stop stop the bleeding. You don't need to stop the bleeding. Um, you're not bleeding that fast. If you have really low health, yeah. Ooh, was that shock? That's my shit, dude. When I see ice, I pass that up. I know of this little cabinet. See... I know where all the little cabinets and stuff are in this area, so I can... Uh, it's all about, for me, getting med kits and shit. Was that the dude that almost killed me earlier? I think he was wearing a red shirt or something. Ooh. That sucks for him, dude. He had a good weapon. He could've put up a good fight. That's too bad. Mine now. Oh yeah, I said fuck it. You know what, I'll go ahead and extract this shit. He did all the work. Fuck it. 
Yep. Basically, I get carried by other people. And then this shit popped up in my window. I think this is where my audio got fucked. Yeah. It wasn't an update. It was this bullshit. That's what happened. Son of a bitch. Computers, man. I hate electronics. They're always fucking with me. I just like to get a little armor off that guy for no reason. I actually do that. If I see those dudes, I can usually kill them pretty easily. Get some armor. It helps. Oh, fuck yeah. Guns. How many have I killed? I've killed three so far, I think. Killed three dudes. These humans, you should usually be able to just vault off of them and then uh, drop attack them. I call it air assassinating, but... Fuck yeah, shotgun. I don't like using the shotgun trying to do this because... I don't know. I think it'd be way cooler to do it with just melee weapons, but... Whatever. People usually have shotguns and pistols and shit by now. I'd rather have the shotgun, if you know what I'm saying. Another good tip, if you're stuck in the uh, animation where you're about to do a heavy swing or if you are you have an arrow cocked or whatever, I don't know. When you're pulling back on the arrow, you can just kick and cancel the animation. No problem. Big fight coming up. Look at all these dudes. Wow, that dude got fucked. Sucks when somebody comes up behind you. Yeah, right here. I didn't want to shoot them. I wanted to fight them. I, I don't know if I actually use a shotgun. Like I said, I just, I would just rather have it. Do I really miss all that? Jesus, man. Oh yeah, I said fuck that. I get killed a lot by dudes using those arm guards. One thing I can't handle is parry. When somebody's really good at parry, I don't know why, I just can't wrap my mind around how to parry or how to counter a parry. It's fucking weird. Well, actually, I'm good at faking out. Pretend like I'm gonna do a heavy hit, but then I kick them, and that stuns them when they're doing a parry. I can get some hits on them. Another tip. Shit's gold. See, at this point, I do not want people killing each other. I want to get the kills. I'd rather get the kills. I'm trying to get this goddamn record, man. I gotta beat six, so I gotta get seven kills. Gotten four kills, that means... And there's like, what, four or five guys left in the match? I've gotta kill pretty much everybody. I gotta be quick. That's the guy that almost killed me earlier. <laughs> I love pain relievers, man. You can sprint. Fuck yeah. I fucking... I love doing the, the jump. And smack down. It's like you slam their head into the ground. Love that animation. It's a 1v1 situation. 
See, since I've got the, uh, I've got, uh, Vengeance can't, you know, board the helicopter, so I can do whatever I want, basically. So I'm gonna go for this drop. I have maximum radar range, so you can see that red on the very edge of the radar. I know he's way far toward the helicopter. He's just sitting there waiting for me. Oh yeah, pain relievers, dude. Pain relievers are the best. That mine almost killed me. Remember that shit, like... Wow, that would have been so dumb to get killed by a mine right there. Like, are you fucking kidding me? Just a random ass mine. So I, I actually had more than four kills. I had five kills and I killed the dude that almost killed me in the beginning. So I had six kills right now. Doing fucking awesome. I swear, dude, you have to kill so many dudes just to get this amount of kills. And there are people out there who actually have gotten more kills. Uh, Dankin, he's a Twitch streamer. He said he's gotten eight or nine kills in a match. I can't imagine that. You have to kill nine people. If you get nine kills, you're one of those people, you know, one of the 12. So that means that two other people got killed by somebody else. He has a good fucking weapon right there. I fucked him up. Hell yeah, dude. Yep, there's my celebratory shooting guns up in the air. Goddamn Middle Eastern uh, wedding style. Motherfucker. Oh yeah, look at me. Oh, I won. So cool. How many kills did I get? Seven. Hell yeah, John. Take it. Take it, John. Take it just like that, John. Fuck your six kills. He has to get eight kills now to beat my seven. Ha! And here's another little match. Same thing. My mic was gone. Believe this. Yeah, this was after the seven kill match. So I was feeling pretty good. I still. Now I gotta. I wanna beat my own personal best. So I gotta get eight kills next. So. I'm gonna keep playing like this. It's way funner than just looting and trying to get, you know, uh, extract blood samples. Just run around, kill other motherfuckers, and take their shit instead. You get your blood samples so fast when you do that too. Oh yeah. I remember actually thinking of I should lead those dudes into that building and just throw a grenade in there. Make quick work of them. These guys are kind of a pain in the ass. Vaulting off of them, they'll like dodge back. It's like they know the DFA is coming. Sons of bitches. Now I have a little bit of radar. So how the radar works is, so you start off level one and your radar will only light up in the middle if somebody's, you know, really close to you. And then when you become level two, um, that's when you can see a little bit further away from you. Level three, a little bit further. I'm going to make a video on that, and I'll show exactly how the radar works. But, uh, yeah, I'll be covering that in a future video. Just, like, basics on the mechanics of bad blood. But, uh, yeah, now I'm looking for motherfuckers, and... This match isn't going so good. I should have three kills by now. 
And I'm not finding anybody, so. Oh yeah, do pain relievers. Always check those uh, vans. It's worth, like, I love having six pain relievers, dude. And maybe one med kit. I suck at parry. He's fucked. That is so weird. The military machete is such a piece of shit weapon, man. It barely hurts people. I hate that one. Now, this weapon, the scythe, is really good. It's got good reach, and it does a good amount of damage. It's weird. In this game, like, the two-handed... It's not a two-handed weapon. It's not like a sledgehammer, but... You know, it's like the katana. It's... You hold it with two hands when you swing it, but they're probably the my favorite weapons. Cricket bat is even good in this game. Any baseball bat is pretty decent. So my radar is lit up in the middle. I know somebody's nearby, but I don't hear anything, so I'm thinking they're watching me. They moved away. You can guess pretty much where people are at just by looking at your mini-map. You'll see a hive, and if, you, if there's somebody in that direction, you know that they're there. Sometimes they're not, though. It's weird. It's like you, you're playing hide-and-seek. Some people just play real skittish, man. It's weird. Oh yeah, that guy has a hatchet. These guys, a lot of the time, they'll be carrying a legendary hatchet. And they almost fucking kill me right there. Holy shit. Sucks when the game kills you, dude. I've been killed by a goon. Once. And I think maybe even a viral. I want that hatchet so bad. <laughs> Two hatchets. Hell yeah, dude. Get rid of that piece of shit. Military machete. Damn, I got rid of 14 arrows. Well, dude, I play with the Xbox controller, so it's kind of useless. I'm bad with ranged weapons, which is unfortunate. This guy's fucking close. behind me I hear him yep I heard him. you got the drop on me this is why I love these pain relievers look at that basically full health again I couldn't have done that without pain relievers they're so important especially when you get shot with like an arrow or something or they throw hatchets at you Gotta have pain relievers. I'm trying to get his pain relievers right now. <laughs> Place my own. Hell yeah. See, the other players, they do all the work for you. Why go through all the hassle of extracting and all that crap when you could just go around and take other people's shit off their cold, dead, lifeless body? That's my favorite way to play. These little shit bags are so annoying, they fuck you up. Lucky ass fine. Yeah, I haven't watched these uh, since I recorded. Th like, this happened hours ago.
two people nearby. One of them is sneaking around. Being a total wuss about it. And I'm trying to find them. Yeah, they're making no noise. It's like they're just hoping I go away. <laughs> A lot of people hiding. It's so weird. Why do they do that? This game's way more fun if you just attack people. Like, I lose so... Like, I lose most of the time. My kill to uh, win ratio is like I've got more kills than wins. Or matches total. Oh my god, I fucked that guy up. How many kills did I get this time? Is this a six kill? I'm trying to find people. It's that same dude that was hiding from me. I remember this now actually. I couldn't figure out if he was AFK or what. Yeah, I gave up on him. I said, fuck it. Oh, I heard something. There's a shield right there, man. When I'm in the game, like play, like right now watching, I can see a lot of things like I didn't notice at the time when I was playing, but people keep pointing out like, you're missing this and that, and it's annoying, but you gotta understand, when I'm in the game, I'm, I'm planning what I'm gonna be doing next. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm gonna be... Okay, so, there's two people near me. There's one guy to my left. I heard the goon throwing rocks, and that's that's a sign that somebody's right there. But yeah, I'm planning, you know, I'm thinking about what I need to be doing next. I could be taking a sip of goddamn Red Bull. You never know. Look at all the hatchets, dude. These guys have hatchets for days. Yeah, if you ever want a legendary weapon, just find these dudes and kill them. They're easy to kill. All you gotta do is vault off of them. You can also get that. Ooh, fuck. Another shotgun round? I never find shotguns. It's always pistols for me. Well, like, usually. I found a lot of shotguns. Mango is already level five. Yeah. I think it's just the three of us left. So AFK guy, gives a shit about him. Just ran right past him. According to my radar, there's actually four of us left. That can't be right. Yeah, there's four. Me, some dude to my right, uh, mangoes in front, AFK dude way back there. How many dudes did I kill in this match, I wonder? Can't wait to see. I remember getting a six kill uh, match. 
I'm not good with fucking ranged weapons. <laughs> I need to stick to melee. Oh god. I'm getting my ass kicked. I better get that kill, dude. Aww. He's gonna die. Oh shit. Oh shit. That's fucked up. How many kills did I get? There are so many dudes left. AFK guy finally started. Dude, he was hiding. Why was he hiding? That's why I love pain relievers. Yeah, he had full shield. Fuck this guy. He was just hiding with full shield and all that stuff. I wonder how many kills he got during the whole game. Probably none. I'm guessing. It's an interesting tactic, I guess. Oh my god, that fucked him up. Wow, how many kills did I get during that game? Hell yeah. That went way better than I remembered. That looked like a six kill game to me. The taunts are so silly. I can't wait till we have our custom taunts that we can do. What? No, 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 no. Okay. Well, I'm going to go ahead and have the little montage I like to do at the end of these rounds. And we'll go ahead and see how many kills there were, really. But uh, yeah, guys, um, I usually, um, I've never had to do this before. In the past, I've had the uh, headphone problem where it's in the right ear and shit. So what I would do is I would have to listen to my audio and mimic myself, basically. And it came off, you know, disingenuine. Is that how you put it? But it didn't sound genuine. People caught on to it. You know, they're like, it didn't really sound like you were doing it live. Like, I copied myself, you know, as close as I possibly could. But anyways, guys, thanks for watching. And as always, I will see you in the next video.